What is up YouTube? Welcome back. This is Work Knife Balance and we have a fun video for you all today. Before we get started, I want to just go ahead and say thank you to everyone who has already liked and subscribed to our channel. It's because of you that we continue to make content and so thank you very much for supporting us. If you haven't, you can go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below or the little logo in the corner here and that'll let you know when we make content because we're going to keep making it so we would love for you to keep seeing it. Um, but yeah, today we've got the Pichu 2. This is a fun little multi-tool. It's a six-in-one titanium multi-tool. I've had this uh, for a while now. This is an EDC for me. I carry this in my pack every day. I've used it quite a bit. I've used it on trail with my bike. I've used it backpacking. Um, I've had it uh, at work for a couple cuts and opens and pries here and there. And I find a lot of functionality in this little guy right here. This Pichu 2, Pichu 2 tool comes in at about four and a quarter inches long, so it is not big by any means. You can fit this in any pocket really, fanny pack, pouch, backpack, whatever you carry, this will work for you and it works really well. I will say the carry style with this uh, milled titanium clip is wonderful, but the placement of it is not the best you end up putting it in a pocket with a good chunk sticking out. You got that like dinosaur head rah, sticking out there for you. So um, I end up using that more than anything just to have it fastened in my backpack so it's not sliding around and I just have it on like a little strap in there so I know where to grab it more than actually carrying it in my pocket. But my absolute favorite thing about this is this little wrench head at the top here. This is a adjustable wrench head and it works surprisingly well for what it is. It is a, just a spring loaded wrench head so it'll clamp down on whatever bolt you need to use and then you get good torque behind it wrenching over this way. So it is an absolute fantastic, really good ergos on it with this little kind of edge here. You can really lean into it and pull back on it. And that's been fantastic. I've used this wrench um, on my bike, on trail, like I said. I've used it in the garage when I couldn't find the correct size. I knew this was adjustable. Hey, let me just open this up real quick like I need to. And that's been really good. You got a bottle opener on the bottom here. Never actually used it, but um, it is there if you need it. So that's been something that's been pretty cool. I've used that bottle opener more as like a area to, to like get leverage for other things than an actual bottle opener. A good pry on the other side, so you've got a really nice good pry bar on the other side. I've used this tip to clean out some gunk areas where I need to get a larger pry in there before. And so it's been really handy to use that and have that on the other side. Also, just the way that design is, like we mentioned, allows you to get really good leverage when you are trying to use this opposite wrench head side over here. You do have a lanyard hole in it if you ever wanna hang it or have it um, carried by that functionality right there. And then this is one piece that I think is absolutely fantastic. You have a magnetic quarter inch bit on the bottom here. So if you've got a small magnetic bit set that you can keep with you, which I do in my pack, um, I can just throw one of those in here if I ever need to, hold it and then be able to use as such, which is absolutely fantastic. That's a piece that I think a lot of multi-tools are missing. Um, They'll have a, a Phillips, they'll have a flat head. Um, they may have a Torx, but they don't have a way to interchange a lot of times. You can buy extra pieces for them, but they're typically uh, specific to that multi-tool. This is really nice to have that quarter inch that sits right in there magnetic and then twists over. I haven't had um, much use for it. I've used a flat head in there and I've used a Phillips and a Torx in there before, but um, just using if I've got a knife I need to take apart with the Torx on one side and the other free spins, this will hold in place so I can twist off the other side. And that's been handy to have that there. And then last, the sixth little piece, we've got one, two, three, four, five, and the sixth little piece would be this scalpel knife right here. So it's really nice when you have a blade on a multi-tool. Obviously, most of us are gonna be carrying a knife every day anyways, but when you have a multi-tool out and you have a blade on it, it's nice to be able to have a small blade to make little cuts so you don't have to pull your knife out always. And this little scalpel blade has been absolutely useful for that exact reason. I've used this for opening boxes, I've used this for cutting foam board on prototypes and um, little designs that I've made and stuff like that. This little scalpel blade has been fantastic. 
And it's nice because it is a replaceable blade. If I ever need to, I can just pop that off. They have extras on their website. You can get them on Amazon too. There's nothing um, really specific about this one that won't fit on others. And so you can get that pops right off and then you can put another little blade on there that is sharp as ever. And so it's fantastic to have that. So if it ever does dole out, get rolled over, tip break, whatever reason I need to, I can replace it. I don't have to worry about the blade on this at all. So I can just pop that off and put a new one on. This P22 is, uh, absolutely fantastic and as of this video they are still available i believe they're 90 dollars on the pichu website i will go ahead and link that website below uh, i don't have an affiliate with them or anything so that website is just go check it out if you like it pick one up for yourself i think they are fantastic tools like i said i have this one with me six out of seven days of the week 355 days a year it's usually in my pocket or in my backpack close by so it's a fantastic tool absolutely love it wanted to bring this to y'all and show you a little bit about it but don't have much else to say so i'm gonna go ahead and leave it there uh, if you guys have a tool that you carry, something that you keep with you every day, what is your multi-tool that you use aside from your blade? Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear and check out what you guys have got going on and what you carry. I always like to see new gear. I always like to see other stuff. I want to see what other people are carrying. Compare my carry to theirs and just see how we can sharpen each other a little bit, get the best gear out there. So yeah, thanks for taking a look at it. Until next time, TTFN.